morning everybody. Good morning. We are going to start off this morning here at the Alani Resort. We are. On that right there. Yes. It's a canoe ride. It is. It is one of the excursions that you can sign up here right at the Alani, right at the rental place. Yes. So yeah, over a hundred dollars a person. Yeah, I'll put the exact price right mm -hmm. here. But you, and you know it's gonna be fun. We're just waiting. We got the first, you can do it the same day, so you don't have to do it in advance. We got the first sailing, which is at 8.30. It's eight mm -hmm. o'clock right now. We already checked in, so we're just waiting for our turn. Yeah, not only us though. Yeah, the kids are here. Yeah, there they are, look. They look very excited yeah. to start this. very excited. So uh, yeah, we'll see you on the boat. Yep. We are ready. We're just waiting for our turn. They give us life jackets. Yeah, I think it's only going to be the four of us, right? Yes, I believe so. Yeah, look. Own private tour. Yeah. We're ready. Everybody's ready. Look at that. Yep, it's our own private. Yes. Just got you. loaded on the boat. And we're chilling. Yeah. They're getting on right there? In and out, basically like that. Yeah, so we have to kind of stay like this. Uh, yeah, until we're out of the channel. Yeah, then you got to just move around, right? Then we can kind of move right? around, but not to stand up because you'll slip. Not only that, but you're going to hit your head, head on the boom right yeah. there. You don't want that. Oh, here we go. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. Good story time. We did see a seal. We didn't know that over on the other side of the Four Seasons, it, there's a, a lot of snorkeling over there. Yeah, a little coral reef. Going yeah, on it's over really there. neat. And from the from the boat, from the kayak, you can just look down in the water because it's so clear, and you can see the coral. Yeah, the it's about, coral. What, about 15 feet down. Or yeah, so? it's only 15 feet down. Yeah, and they have snorkeling over at the Four Seasons. You can sign up for the same company mm -hmm. but at the four seasons you can sign up for their snorkeling adventures and that's where they take you and he's saying that's crazy it's like you're you're stuck in someone's aquarium right when right. you're when you're snorkeling over there yeah so. the whole experience is about an hour or so but it, yeah. go, it goes by quick it does it yeah. does and it's a lot of fun yeah uh wet wise we didn't get wet yeah. at all just splashing just, on the way in a little bit yeah so if you're you know, wondering if you're like completely submerged or anything like that and we have a windy we're, we're supposed to be windy today and we got maybe just a little bit of a splash, didn't completely get wet yeah. at all. You know, like on cruise ships, I, I could tend to get seasick, but on this, nothing. Nothing. Either. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's, I think because you're so close to the water, Yeah. that's probably why. And yeah, it's fine. the water was so clear. Yeah. So clear, yeah. so it was nice. Yeah, we can recommend this one. Yes. For lunch, we got to Marukame Udon. Uh, or Marugame. That's right. We're at the downtown location, not downtown, I'm sorry. We're at the Chinatown location, which is a little less busy than the one that's in Waikiki. Oh, there's yeah. no line here. There's tons of seating here. Yes. That's not squishy like the other one's a little bit closed quarters. This yeah. one's a lot more room. Of course, the other one is right in the heart of Waikiki. Yeah. But there's always a line, like you mentioned. Yes. yes. But th this is the first time we're going to eat here. Yes. But look, there's just no line. People are just kind of walking in. And there's tons of seating. Oh, yeah. The dining room, it just opened up. It's oh, actually it opened up about an hour ago. It's 11 yes. o'clock right now. And the dining room is not even half full. Yeah. And they have outside seating. Let's go eat. Let's go. Hi. They're 
making their own noodles. The person over there is cutting the noodles right now. They warm them up. You can see some noodles already there in that little netting, that basket right there. Yeah, so it's just like the other location where they, yeah. where they hand make it. Same thing, same thing. And then you place your order over here. Here are your tempura toppings. It's extra, but you get what you want. Oh yeah, here we go. Shrimp tempura right here. These are all per piece. And this. What do you think, eh? Got a lot of stuff here, huh? So many, so many choices. I know I'm like. I, I usually, I love tempura, so I'm going to go crazy. It's, it's really good to have that soak it into that soup, right? Oh, yeah. They also have inari, some spam musubi, and some uh, salmon musubi. A couple ways to eat the tempura. You could get your tempura dipping sauce on the side, or you could just get your tempura and put it with your soup, or in my case, with the curry. Oh, it's really good. Yes. Look at that. Wow. How's that, babe? It is delicious. Every time I get this, it is very consistent and very good. I got their best seller right here. This is the one with the sweet beef in it. Look at those noodles are perfectly cooked. They make the noodles and then they go ahead and cook them on the side. Then they put them to your bowl. Here's with the sweet meat and those noodles. Let's go ahead and try this one out. This is perfect. It's a very simple, not too overly powering broth. Since we're here in Chinatown, yes. we yes. are going to go to one of the best roast pork here. Yes, well, we think it's the best. We haven't tried it yet. Well, it's a, we have to give a shout out to Authentically Charles. He's yes. one of our YouTube buddies. Mm -hmm. And uh, he, he tried a lot of them. And he, he said did. this one was the best one. Well, we got to try it out. We know yeah. it's the skin. It's the juiciness of the meat. And that ratio, fat and, and meat, right? fat Everything. and meat ratio. It all has to work together. All righty, Charles. We are putting you up to the contest. We'll yes, see. yes. Let's go get some. All righty. Uh, minimum order, half pound. Yes, so we have it here. Is this is eight, the size. Eight bucks or something? Eight sixty-six. Okay. Half pound. All righty, let's go peel this in. They cut it. It's in a like, like strips, and so they cut it fresh. Yeah, when you hear that wooden butcher block chopping, you know yeah. you're at the right place, mm -hmm. right? It sounds just like my my dad. There you go. Oh, look at that. Look at that ratio of the fat and the meat. That looks like a lot of fat. Let's try the meat part. Here you go. Ratio. Yeah, the try fat it out, babe. And the meat. Let's try it first. Oh, you try it. Mm -hmm. The crunchiness of that skin. Mm -hmm. Let me have mm -hmm. that piece right there. Oh, look at that's that one. That's a big one. one. You got your skin. Show the skin. There you go. That's pretty good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good crunch. crispy skin. Good season. Mm -hmm. That's for Angie. Mm. 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 Good seasoning. That's good seasoning. Mm -hmm. Wow. I just need some rice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why I need some rice. Yeah. You can tell the seasoning is a little bit on the salt side, but that's perfect for this type of meat because it's so fatty. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's too salty, but it's uh, seasoned really well. Yeah. Like you said, this a hot bowl of rice, and you're that's set. It. You're set. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good job, Charles. Yeah, thank Charles. Made us stop at the Ala Moana Mall. Yes, we're doing a little bit of shopping here. I love coming here with the Christmas decorations, like this tree right behind us. Yes. And we're doing, again, doing a little shopping. That's right. We little picked holiday up, uh, shopping. up another backpack. Another because backpack. Because again, we bought too much stuff and yes. we got to take it home. Yes, and Christopher's going home. Actually, we bought two backpacks because he didn't bring a backpack this trip yeah. for a good reason. And Christopher didn't bring a backpack for good reason. So two backpacks so they can take some stuff home. That's right. See, mm -hmm. we're planning ahead. We are. 
had to make a stop at the Honolulu Coffee Company to put a Hawaiian latte. Yeah, this is one of my favorites. First time getting it over ISO. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Mm. What do you think? That slight hint of coconut, right? Yeah. In it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I couldn't put my finger on it. I thought, well, mine has oat milk, so mm -hmm. you can taste the oat in it, but I do taste a slight bit of coconut. It's really right. nice. And you, we didn't add any sugar or anything else. It's the way it comes. Yeah, Hawaiian latte, yeah, I recommend this one. Yes, yeah, a nice picker upper. Yes. Look at that, they have a big island candy pop-up. This is a pop-up. I believe it's only here until January. All your big island cookies or candies are here. Everything looked delicious. We had to hold back, but we just get, did get one gift. Just get one gift. And, uh, you get a cool but bag with it. Get a cool bag with it. And right across the way is right now I go to a Japanese pastry spot and we're going to go walk in there. Yeah, just to let you know that yeah. Big Island Candies is from Hilo, Hawaii, yes. on the Big yes. Island. Mm -hmm. So this is only like the second location right now. Yes. But luckily you can buy it online. You can. So in Macy's, Erin went to the restroom, but in Macy's we just noticed here's the Laliha Bakery. What's nice is not only a bakery, but it's a full restaurant. Let's go check it out. This is their Chantilly cake, but they did not have any slices. They only have the full cake. So we're gonna skip on the Chantilly cake, but this is amazing. Hopefully the squares will taste just as good. All right, let's see what you got from Lily Hot Bakery. Yeah, that was pretty cool. That was in the Macy's. Right. So it's like a full restaurant in there. They didn't have, if you, if you didn't hear me before, they didn't have the the Chantilly cake yeah. in a slice. They only had it in the full cake, but instead I got the Cocoa Puff, Cocoa Puff, I got a banana something and a, and a square. Oh, Butter Square. I think yeah. it's called Butter Square. Okay, let's try but the most popular item here. The most popular item is their Cocoa Puff. Here we go. Let's go ahead and try this out. It's like a Chantilly, right? Isn't it? Mm. it tastes like a caramel, a really smooth oh, yeah. caramel. It There's is. a performance going on right now, so that's why I have the noise. Not the noise, but the music. Here we go. Go ahead, baby. Same time. Okay. Same One, time. two, three. <laughs> mm. That is good. Mm -hmm. The um, the cocoa pop part, let's take the uh, chocolate cream. It's very light in flavor. Oh, that's it's very good, good chocolate flavor, though. Yeah. And it's cold. Yes, yeah, so along with that little, uh, I guess, pastry. And it's absolutely filled to the brim, to the point it was um, bursting out. And this is the little caramel on top of it. Yeah. That was good. I can see how this is the most popular item that they have. Mm -hmm. A lot of people get it to go. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye. Mm. Yeah. Good stuff. That's good stuff. Mm -hmm. What you getting, babe? We're gonna go for the number four. Check it out. It's called the Eha. E e Three flavors. You get an ice cream and a sweet and condensed milk topping, aka snow cap. So uh, with the Mickey ears, pay a little extra, one dollar. But it's worth it since we're here. You gotta do it. We we'll do it. Right, flavors. Here we go. This is a pretty good size, actually. That right? really is, yes. Yeah. So, yeah, let's see how it compares. Yeah, we have the vanilla ice cream in the middle, and we uh -huh. have condensed milk on top. Right. This is the grape, Ling Hing Mui, and strawberry. Yes. Let's try this out. I'm going to go straight for the Ling Hing Mui, right? Yeah, me too. Cheers, babe. Cheers. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's good. It, it, it is good. It's not quite quite finely shaved like uh like right. Matsumoto's or something right but it, it is good it's good yeah mm. you know what if you want shave ice in a pinch, in a pinch yeah this is good right it, um it's just not that snow snowy soft right, pillowy right. soft ice if you've never had it before and you want to try it out yeah i'd get it here yeah. But because we've been to several shaved ice places, mm -hmm. this is pretty legit com with those shaved ice. But of course, those shaved ice places do have that homemade syrup and stuff. Yes. This one, the, the syrup does taste a little artificial, but it's good. If you've never had it before, 
Or if you have kids that can't tell the difference, this is perfect. So I'll tell you what, if you have Mickey ears, nobody what else more, does. Nobody what else more can does, you right? ask for? Yeah. You got to get it for the Mickey ears. Yep. It's fun. It's good. And it's good. I'm going for the ears. Hey, is this your first time in the Lazy River? <laughs> How's that water? Nice and warm? Oh, it's amazing. Oh my God, it's so warm, like it was preheated. <laughs> We're back on the Lazy River enjoying the amenities they have here. And we're going pretty fast because we have somebody yeah, pulling us. <laughs> we're trying to catch up to Aaron. Yeah, he's he's tubeless. Uh -oh. Oh, there she is. What happened to you two? What happened to you two? I gave it away because I wanted to swim like you. Oh, okay. Okay. So we signed up for making our own Mickey ears. It is $36 per person and this is how we select it. Um, you did purchase the lighted ones, so you're gonna select which lighted ones you want. So we have gold and multi, so it's our holiday season. Mm -hmm. Gold, red, and black and multicolor. Otherwise, so we're white, black with purple, gold with gold, pink with pink, and black with white. Okay. So once you select that, you're just going to write that. It's going to lay out. Yes, okay. exactly. Oh, yeah. Okay, thank you. Have fun. You have two minutes. Wow. <laughs> I hope okay. he's dead in. So you didn't get that. We well, pick what ears you want. These are multicolored, and this is the different, like, solid lights. Then you have five things you can pick on your ears which is going to be kind of hard, but we'll see. Okay, we had fun at the pool. Now yes. we're at the ABC right across the street. Yes, and this is how we're getting our dinner today. Today is Thursday, so Tuesdays and Thursdays, and thinking on Saturdays, they have their permit, so I have to try to get the permit. Yeah, and I got I the uh, hamburger steak. Yes, yes, right. so we're going to go ahead, try that out, and uh, see how it is. Yeah, I'll let you know. Until yes. then, we'll see you tomorrow morning. Yes. Right outside the Ulu Cafe is the coffee shop which is right here. It's only open from 6 to 10.30. And this is where you can get your specialty coffees, your espressos and mochas and stuff like that. Yeah, it doesn't appear to be food, so just drinks only here. Yeah. And here are the prices for Yeah, them. this is Wailana right here. And there's the Ulu Cafe for a reference. There you go, right here. So uh, regular coffee is like five bucks. So you could almost do what we did and uh, get your coffee and yeah. uh, just make it here, right? Yeah, exactly. And, and then here, what was interesting is when we went to Foodland and we went to Target, they saw all the Hawaiian coffees and Kona blends and everything. But the Honolulu Coffee Company, which is our favorite, is sold here on the property. So the ears are done. Yes. It looks very festive. Look at that. Thank you. You hit my Thank ear. You. I'm sorry. I, nothing happened, okay? Okay. I know they light up, but they, uh, they, they look nice. Oh, yeah, okay. actually, yeah, you, you can see it. And we even have the back decorated. Oh, okay. <laughs> hers, yeah. is a, uh, hers is a bit more, I think, well, obviously better than mine, but. That's also, the, uh, that's the back side of the ears. And I also really, well, <laughs> I also really like this little snowflake right there. It's so cute. <laughs> Good touch. Good job, guys. From the Ulu Cafe this yes. morning, mm -hmm. we got a acai bowl. It's good size. Yes, it is. It's got some great weight to it. And this is the the, the one for the tropical, right? Yes. But they didn't have any, what, papaya? They didn't have any papaya. Yes. So the tropical comes with the mango and the uh, pineapple and the coconut. Mm -hmm. The traditional just comes with the strawberries, the banana, and the blueberries, I believe. Mm -hmm. right. Yes. So we got the strawberries on this one. We did. So we, we substituted. We were able to substitute our papaya with some strawberries. Yes. Plus they could put some honey drizz on it. Yeah, they did. Yes. Let's Let's try this. Try, yeah. Cheers. Cheers, mate. Ding. Good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Great taste of the uh, acai berry. Mm -hmm. The consistency, because it is still cold, it is it's not soupy or anything no. like that. Yeah. 
great crunch from the granola. It's a really good granola. It's not really on the sweet side, even with that honey drizzle. This uh, tropical bowl is 12 bucks. So this is a good size, I and mean, especially for us to share. Yeah. Really good size. And this will really fill you up, or definitely fill you up if you're just eating it by yourself. Well, I think the mm -hmm. tropical is seventeen dollars, but with your um, mm. the forty percent. Oh, was that my twenty? Yeah, I think oh, it was wow. at seventeen dollars. Okay. I thought it was ten, twelve dollars. Okay. Yeah. But and I'll put the price on the bottom. This is a great thing to share because we're gonna definitely eat more food later. Yes. But we're gonna be uh, closing out. Yes, for this video. one. Mm -hmm. Yes. Give me a shout out yes. Uh, we have Karen Tanaka's birthday. Happy birthday, Deanna and Savannah. We saw you at the Ala Moana yesterday. Thank you so much yes. for saying hi. And to your husband, who, even though he wasn't there, but and to your husband, thank you so much for watching. And we just met Kathleen and Jeff. Yes, we downstairs. Did. They're staying here at the Alani. We just saw them downstairs as we were ordering our food. Yes. Thank you so much for watching, and I'm waiting for that recommendation in Right, Vegas. right. Mm -hmm. Just uh, email us or send us a message. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so that's going to be doing it for our stay here at the Alani. Mm -hmm. We had a, a great five days. It went by kind of quick. I it actually did. Well. So the so our little babies are going home tomorrow, which is a Saturday, and we're staying for four more days in Waikiki. Yeah, Erin's sad about that. Yeah. She's not ready to go home yet. So we're staying four more days in Waikiki. So we're really looking forward to that one. Yes. So mm -hmm. uh, stay tuned for our next set of vlogs, which will be in Honolulu, Waikiki. Area. Yes. Mm -hmm. So until those adventures, we'll catch you guys on the next one. So the overall stay here at the Elani, how did you feel, baby? Um, I really enjoyed myself over here. I did not find it too Disney heavy. By that I mean there's no Disney in your face type of activities mm -hmm. or even walking around the property. It really looks like Hawaii over here. Yes, it's a, a very much so of a resort. If you want to be very Disney, you can. They do have character meet and greets every single day. Uh, you just have to look on their app or they even have a printed copy of when you can do character meet and greets. You can do, there's tons of activities here. So if you're staying here with a family, this is ideal because everything is here on the resort. You don't even have to go into the city. If right. you have little ones and you know, sometimes it's a, it's just more of a feat just to go out and do something here. You don't have to, you can do everything here. Even in the five days that we're here, we still didn't get to try every eating option here. Right, right. Um, would we stay here again? Uh, maybe. Uh, it was a little bit costly, so maybe we would stay here again. Yeah. Uh, it was nice for this first trip, though. Yeah. Uh, was there any, the service is impeccable. Um, what else, baby? Was there anything well, else? Well, the activity. I love that little Not canoe activity. Busy. That was really fun. If your family is a big pool people and lounging people, you will love this resort. Yeah. Pool and lounging, you know, uh, you know, for us, we, we like to get up and go. So for us, it was a bit of a further drive for everything to do. But if your family is lounging and pool, you're going to spend all your time here. Yeah, especially and that it, lazy river. And the amenities Very relaxing. and everything like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, was there anything else? I think that was it. That was a yeah. good wrap up of the resort. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Recommend it. We yep. had lots of fun. Yeah, we had lots of fun. And thank you again for all of the cast members that said hi to us mm -hmm. while we were here. Yep. Okay, now we can wrap it up, babe. Yes. We'll catch you on the next one.